First of all, Nick, congratulations. They, uh, a tough game throughout. You must be, must be thrilled with the result. Yeah, it's always a tough game against Exeter. Uh, you saw last year when we played them. I know we were in probably a bit of a downward slip, but uh, you know, we thought we had them beat and they came back and won it last couple of minutes. So for us to grind it out and get the win was, was massive. And you know, in conditions that probably suit their game more than it suits ours, our determination showed through. The, uh, both teams kept the pressure on throughout the game, so you must be thrilled with how it went. Yeah, and we spoke about it. You know, What we do have in common with Exeter is is a work rate that's uh, throughout the squad and I think that comes from you know, Paddy Anson's joined us this year and he was at Exeter before so he's instilled the same mentality in us that, that Exeter have and um, we're just happy that ours, ours shone out on top and that's the difference that, uh, that Paddy makes I think and also the collective spirit that he's built in this squad Horrible conditions here tonight as well that must, that must have uh, helped with the win um, I don't mind it's, uh, it's kind of a levelling factor the fast guys don't look so quick and I'm about the same speed so yeah I'm happy with it. Uh, 16,000 fans here tonight, or just over that, so you must be great, you must be uh, thrilled with the, the home support. Just how important is it having that home advantage? Yeah, the 16th man, whether it's 10,000 or 16,000, it's just it's incredible. And you know that every home game they're going to turn out for you, and as long as you deliver spirits on the pitch and passion, and in terms of performance, that's what they want to see the spirits and the passion. And you know, the result, more often than not, will follow, but certainly in terms of what the fans want, I think that's, that's what they want to see on the pitch, and as long as you deliver that, they're happy. There's always going to be a few little niggling errors as well in every game, so are we looking to get those ironed out before next weekend? Yeah, we are, but then we had to adapt in the game because it's the warm-up, everything looked OK. We thought it was going to be pissing down the rain, but you know, the heavens opened sort of into the second half, so we had to adapt our game and probably could have held on to the ball a little bit longer at the end, but in the end, you know, it didn't make any difference. We managed to, to squeeze out the win.